Welcome to Dance Equations. I'm Dash, the Duchess of Digits. A digit is a symbol used to make numbers, and I love numbers. I also love to dance. In today's dance adventure, we're going to be exploring space. I'm exploring space. Before we can choreograph with math and dance, we need to create our own vocabulary of movement. We do that through improvisation. Improvisation can help us warm up our body, it can help strengthen our body, and also allows us to figure out our own quality of movement. To start out with, we're going to do an exercise called Levels, Rounds, and Creative Spaces. In this exercise and improvisation, we will explore the horizon, the horizontal plane of the studio or classroom. Then we will move through the levels, low, medium, high, and in the air. Let's begin. Step one. Clear your space and make sure you have enough room to dance. Step two, explore the horizontal plane. Put on some music and move through the space. Move forwards, backwards, and sideways. Don't forget to be creative and try different pathways like straight lines, circles, or zigzags. Step three, explore the rounds. We're gonna start in a low position, so take an interesting shape on the floor. Now, with the music, explore the lower space, still being creative along the horizontal plane. Step four, we're gonna explore the middle round, moving up a little bit off the floor. Take an interesting shape to begin. When the music starts, you're gonna explore the middle round, being careful not to go all the way down or all the way up. Be as creative as you can with your space. Step five, 
high round and we're going to connect that to working in the air. So the last two rounds together. Make an interesting shape standing. When the music starts, you're going to explore moving through the space all the way up and even add in some jumps, seeing how you can fly through the air. Be creative, still on the horizontal plane. Step six, we're going to connect it all together. So now exploring each realm, low, medium, high, and in the air, as well as your horizontal plane. Be as creative as you can and try to connect your movements. Thanks for dancing with me. See you next time, but until then, rock steady and get your dance equations groove on.